In this tutorial you will learn, how to use the group by filter, included in AppConnect data formatter. The group by filter is useful, when you want to group records, by a certain property. For example, you can group products, by their category. We created a server action, with a query which returns our records. Open the AppConnect tab, and add AppConnect to your page. Then, add a new component. Add server connect. And select your server action. Then, click on your page, where you'd like to display your records. And, add new component. Select repeat region, or repeat children region. And then, select the expression, for the repeat region. Under the server connect component, data, select your query. Then, click the app connect formatter button. Right click your expression. And under collections, select group by. And then choose the property, to group your records by. We want to group our records, by category. Click select, when you are done setting up the group by filter. And click the select button, to apply it, to the repeat region. Now, we combine the name of the property, which we group the records by, inside the repeat region. Just click inside the repeat, and add new binding. Select key, under the repeat component. This returns the value of the property, you are grouping by. In our case, it will show the category name. Now, let's add the products, grouped under each category. Click inside the repeat region. And add another repeat. Select its expression. Under the first repeat component, in the dynamic data picker dialog, select the value binding. And click select. Now, click inside the second repeat, which we nested, and insert a binding. Then, select the binding, which you want to render inside it. In our case this is the product name. And we are done. Now the products will be displayed, grouped by their categories. Additionally, you can add the products count, in each of the categories. In order to do that, click after the key binding on the page, and insert binding. Select value, under the main repeat, and click the formatter button. Right click the expression, and under collection, select count. Click select, in order to insert the binding. And we are done. Let's preview the results. You can see the products, grouped under the categories. Also you can see how many products, each of the categories contains. That's how easy it is, to use the group by filter.